Okay, this is what I decided I'm going to do. Move some stuff out of your way. Uh, it used to have a linkage that went from here up to here. And what that did is when you the pedal's all the way in lock right now, it pulled this up like so. And that will loosen up the belt. As of right now, the belt, it's snug, it works, but... It's not what I, I actually want. What I'm going to do, like I said in a previous video, is go get the other pulley like this. But it, it's a bigger pulley. It's got a wider base. Wider in here. This one would work, but it just wear the belt out too quick. And it's going to go like this. Let me back this camera up a little bit and show you. And that's real tight, that belt. And then by when I pull this up, as you can see where the circle goes, let me pull this up here. Circle's over here. Let's see if I can hold that up there. Alright. The circle's up here, and if I take one of them belts and put it in here, and then pull these, look, it comes out to be perfect. So it'll be nice and loose. And then when it goes down, it's going to push up on that. Now I'll be able to put a keeper on there and everything. All I got to do is make a keeper that goes right where my finger is, my thumb out. So it'll be like a piece of L. That, that'll keep that tight. And then when it goes up, Pull that out of there. Go. Let me get this back up there. When it goes up, it should take that keeper. That keeper's going to be right like this. Uh, yeah, something like that. But I'll I'll make the keeper a little bigger. So that ought to work if I use that existing hole. But what? Let's take it. I gotta come up here where this is and get this weld, take this weld, grind this weld off here, remove that, take this and try and slide it over to here, somewhere in here, then put a, come down here and put a bracket so when I push it in, it pulls it up. The same thing as it did before. Step on this, set it on this side. It's going to be over on this side. And if I have to, I can make one of these, which ain't no problem. Because I have metal. I mean, all I have to do is cut it through here and slide it on. So that's that. Let me know what you think. Okay, I went ahead and got the other pulley. Uh, as you can see, I welded it on there. Uh, not essentially. It's welded pretty good, but it, I could get it back off if I really had to. It's, uh, it, it's not the best weld, but it'll hold. It's pretty smooth. It don't like don't call it look like chicken turds or nothing. It's good, good penetration. So that's what we needed. Got the little, little piece of wire there. Let's see if I can get that back down there. Yep. All right. This has to be trimmed off. But the problem that I got now is the belt's hitting here. And I took the spring off of here. Went, went from here to here. And that was for the uh, lever to engage the... No, uh, the belt or whatever, the deck, I'm sorry about that, brain part there. And then, uh, so I did this, and this does work. Let me put this up here, I'll lock this for you. As you see, and the belt's it's pretty loose. Just, it's it hits right here. So, let me see if I can take that brake back off for you. And you put it back, and it, 
it's tight. I've got two springs here right now. I took the spring off of there and put it down here. See if I can get out of your light here. So, in that belt, it's pretty tight. Which I'm going to replace this spring, or I'll put another one just like this on, a bigger one. And that should work. Everything's done except coming up here. I got to take bolts out over here. Let's see if you can see them bolts there and bolts up there. Take this whole plate off. And then uh, try to wiggle that out of there so I can get this out so I can take care of this. Or what I'm going to have to do is just come in here and cut that straight off. But I'd like to say have this whole piece. But we'll see. Maybe we'll have a run this weekend or whatever. We'll, my buddy might be coming up tomorrow so to work on our truck. So he might you never know the way he is. He likes messing with things. So me and him might mess with it. But you can see how loose that belt is. I mean, so everything's going to work. Just got to finish it up. I'll probably end up taking this piece off and where this rotted, grind it down, re-weld it, make it better because, let me see if I can get you in there. Actually, let me see if I can pull this pulley off for you guys. There you go. Let me try to get you a Brand new glare. There it goes. It, it's not, I mean, there it is. It's not the best of weld, but for what I was working with, it'll hold. But I might grind that off and cut that out. And, because the bolt, these bolts are beveled. Let me show you. There's a smaller one. Uh, let me get this in the camera. Let's see if I zoom in. Maybe not, but you can see it somewhat. It's got a bevel on it, and I'll, it was it was biting. But I I really wanted to make sure it penetrated, so I put a a nice weld across there. I built it up a couple times, which I said I might take that back off because if you look, it's leaning. If I look in here, let me see. That is leaning. This it leans this way and actually down so but see this moves too so I'll go and fix that and then I just gotta take cut I gotta cut this off definitely and I gotta change this around I'm probably I might be able to cut this and shorten and rewall that back together and that should hold or I'll cut it here or somewhere in there and just bend that Rebend it so it fits in there and I'll be good too. So, either way, uh, but it works. I mean, the belt's pretty loose, it's real loose now. But with the pulley on, I think I got just about the right tension on because you see how easy I just put that pulley on. So, now after I get this fixed, it should be fine. But it got, it's got plenty of tension. Off the breaker, getting a little better today. And let me hold this camera back here. It's not a lot, and springs are pulling on. So, all right. Uh, this weekend, I hope to have it moving, and I'll do a test speed and tell you how fast it goes and everything. And then we'll go from there. It's uh, 19 to one. I mean, right now it turns over 19 times. Got a full resolution. To one of these because it's hooked up to the gearbox and everything I believe that was in fourth too I don't quote me on that but I think that was fourth that was high gear so uh, thanks for watching let me know what you think